Hey everyone, well, Pacemaker here. Um, I am back home, so uh, got the haircut and shaved. Feel so much better. Don't feel like uh, hiker trash anymore. So, but uh, yeah, I wanted to do this video and and uh, talk a little bit about the trail. So the trail, uh, you know, what an experience! Uh, what an experience! It was it was fun and. It was great. It had its uh, ups and downs. I think um, probably Washington was my favorite part of the trail. It's it was amazing. Just the uh, scenery, the volcanoes. Um, yeah, it's just it, it was great. It really was. The all my gear uh, worked out great. Um, I did change some gear, and you have to in a through hike because you start out no matter what trail it is um, when you start you start in cooler weather and then it gets hot and so you have to to ship some different things and then it gets cold it gets cool again and then it gets cold uh, toward the end no matter what trail you're on uh, as far as the three big trails so um, I did in Bend um, add a, uh, a bag liner that dropped my 35 degree bag to 28 and that that was a huge difference uh, also had to uh, change up my base layer from a uh, cool weather base layer to a cold weather base layer so <clears throat> just minor changes like that through hikers do all the time and on YouTube they don't always mention it and uh, I do because I, I want hikers to know future hikers through hikers to know you know um, the gear you start out with uh, you'll use most of that gear through the whole hike. Some some pieces of your gear you do have to change up, depending on what what the weather does. You know, so um, I know on a Appalachian 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 Trail, <laughs> Appalachian Trail, you know, people start in February and March, and they're going through snow, and they have to have you know a uh, a pretty cold weather bag. And then by the summer, when the humidity hits, you know, they're not going to be having that bag. You, know, you just got to ship that back home and get something a little bit better. So, or a little bit, you know, uh, a higher rating, you know, 50 degree or whatever. So, but anyways, yeah, everything's going great. Um, had to, uh, uh, you know, getting back into civilization has been tough. Um, I get back home and and I had a welcome party at the airport. That was nice. And uh, but I've been I got home a week ago and I've been home alone ever since. So uh, my wife and I are splitting up. So uh, she's I've only seen her for one day and uh, she's gone. So the uh, home life's been a little tough, but I'm working through it. And, uh, but yeah, the, um, gosh, I can't stop talking about Washington. Just, I, I just loved it. And there's still people finishing. I mean, there's the last part of the crowd's finishing right now. They're finishing in the snow. Some have decided to get off, um, at Hearts Pass, which is 30 miles from the border because it's just getting too dangerous. And I can understand that because, um, you get the trail takes you on the side of these ridges and you put ice and snow there and it 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 gets dangerous so um, you know I hate to hear that from those hikers because uh, you know you're so close but you got to think about yourself too in that in that situation because you don't want to uh, you know make a wrong decision and those hikers they made the right decision so but yeah, so everything's going great. Well, I say great. Everything's going good. And I uh, want to do the quick video. I will try to get my gear together and, and do a gear review and show all the gear that I used and uh, at the different different times. So I will, uh, yeah, I'm going to get off here. It, uh, it did take me four months and three weeks to hike. Um, that was pretty good. I was shooting for four months, and I could have did four months, but, uh, you know, in the last half, I was taking some days off. Um, the mental game's tough, because you do get tired of hiking. Uh, 
waking up every day and doing 25 miles it's just it's like man you know you're ready to go you're just ready for town and sleep in a bed for several days but uh, that's just part of the hike though you know so but anyhow well thanks a lot and again thanks for watching um, it's been a wonderful journey so um, next video thanks again this is pacemaker and happy trails